shot while getting out of their car. Among the victims, three sisters, the youngest just five years old. CBS 2's Audrina Vegas is live at Strozier Hospital with surveillance video of that incident. Audrina. Rob and Erica, the five and 15 year old sisters, are expected to recover, but their 14 year old sister, she is fighting for her life right now in critical condition. Meanwhile, we did get surveillance video from the block in East Garfield Park where this shooting happened, and it proves that these sisters and their family were not the intended target. This family of seven had just walked out of their apartment. We're protecting the identities of three little kids, two teenagers, and two adults who were getting into their car. Moments later, this car pulls up and someone inside starts firing before speeding off. When the car turns the corner, the shooter's arm is still out the window as they continue to fire shots. Frustrating, of course. Uh, we know that there was a gang conflict over there earlier this month, and you know, CPD, along with our federal partners, you know, as you're aware, we took had a big takedown over there. So we're looking into the fact that maybe this is still a little spike up from that particular conflict. Uh, we know that the people involved in the vehicle had absolutely nothing to do with the incident. We know that that's a known location for gang and narcotic loitering. Uh, we need that area enforced. Today, Chicago police posted on corners, detectives combing the area at Homan and Walnut where the shooting happened. This is considered a, a hot spot, um, and so this is a target area that we focus on. Police aren't the only ones here. This man, who didn't want to be identified, works with a neighborhood ministry and responds after shootings. Boy, it used to be like, oh, if they see you with your mother, they would give you a pass, but now it's whenever. And sometimes, and most of the time, they don't even hit their target. That's the case here. First is shot, first is shot. Yeah, I got three shots. Three sisters who were getting into the car, 5, 14, and 15 years old, were all hit. Three documented gang members, presumably the intended targets, were also hit. No arrests have been made. No one is in custody in connection with this shooting. And today, Chicago police tell us that there have been five other shootings with multiple victims. We're talking about 40 people shot in these shootings, 10 of them 17 years old and under. Live outside Strozier Hospital, Adrena Vegas, CBS 2 News. Erica. All right, Adrena, thank you.